We're talking Amazon Kindle versus books. I'm here with Brett Ahrens, Wall Street Journal columnist. You have the Kindle there. Explain to people what it is. I have a book here called Full of Bull. Um, what is it? Why is this it good? Is, this is uh, a, the Kindle. It's an electronic book reader. It was launched about a year ago from Amazon. Uh, they've only just started really marketing it properly. It was on Oprah a couple of weeks ago. Mm. Um, there's three reasons why I'm warming to it, even though I've got some reservations about the way Amazon's done it. The first is, this is a lot lighter than carrying hardback books. Well, you got no muscles? I, got I can carry, you know, I can carry tons and tons of books here. This, this basically can take the place, whether you're going on a holiday or on a trip, um, or even just, you know, going out for a cup of coffee. This is much lighter than a lot of very heavy books. Okay. Second of all, I can, it's got a wireless connection. I can download newspapers and, and magazines. And I don't mean surfing the web, I mean actually downloading the newspaper or the magazine, um, which I like. And the third is, uh, some books, particularly new releases, tend to be cheaper in the electronic version on the Kindle than they would be in the store. Well, I can see all of those things, but it's not very robust, because I, you can't do this with that, can you? And, no. and, and, and you do need batteries for that, and you can't dunk that in the bath. If you dunk this in the bath, you can dry it out, read it, keeps it in integrity. And you can burn this. Good book burning, very traditional experience. Simon, you got me. If you want to smash your books around, throw them in the bath, or burn them, you probably need to buy the traditional old fashioned kind. Uh, these gadgets aren't very good for burning, uh, they're not really very good for throwing in the bath or for jumping up and down on. I just tend to read my books, so that doesn't and really affect me. But, thing but if you want to hold a book burning, you're going to need the old-fashioned books. You can't books. sell those, though. You can't. When you buy a book, if you buy it on Amazon, you can resell it. There is a problem with that with the Kindle. You can't resell it. No, that's true. That's true. I mean, but I, uh, I don't tend to sell my books anyway. Well, it might be good for somebody. Um, one of the two might be good for a Christmas present. Uh, this is Brett Aarons from The Wall Street Journal and me, Simon Collins, from Dow Jones Newswire. Stay tuned for more.